Once there was a young and ambitious individual named Alex, who is struggling to cope with the loss of their job and the breakdown of their relationship. Feeling lost and helpless, Alex is plagued by negative thoughts and emotions, which seem to be consuming their life. They find themselves constantly worrying about the future and dwelling on the past, unable to find peace in the present moment. As Alex's mental state deteriorates, they begin to experience physical symptoms of stress, such as insomnia and headaches. They try to distract themselves with various activities, but nothing seems to alleviate the pain they are feeling. In a moment of desperation, Alex decides to seek help from a therapist, hoping to find a way to regain control of their life. During the therapy session, Alex opens up about their struggles and the overwhelming sense of helplessness they have been experiencing. The therapist listens attentively and suggests that Alex might benefit from exploring the principles of Stoicism, a philosophy that emphasizes the importance of reason, self-control, and indifference to external events. Intrigued by the therapist's suggestion, Alex decides to learn more about Stoicism. They begin by reading books and articles on the subject, but soon realize that they need a more personal connection to truly understand and apply the principles. One day, while walking through a park, Alex encounters an old man named Marcus, who seems to radiate a sense of inner peace and wisdom. Drawn to his calm demeanor, Alex approaches Marcus and strikes up a conversation. As they talk, Alex shares their struggles and their newfound interest in Stoicism. Marcus is delighted to hear about Alex's curiosity and offers to share his own experiences with the philosophy. He tells Alex the story of Zeno of Citium, the founder of Stoicism, and how his teachings have helped Marcus navigate the challenges of life. Marcus explains that Stoicism is not just a set of beliefs, but a way of life that requires constant practice and dedication. As their conversation deepens, Marcus shares some of the core principles of Stoicism, such as the importance of reason, self-control, and indifference to external events. He emphasizes that true happiness and fulfillment come from within, and that by cultivating these qualities, one can find inner peace and strength in the face of adversity. Alex is captivated by Marcus's words and feels a sense of hope and inspiration. They thank Marcus for his wisdom and vow to continue exploring the principles of Stoicism, determined to apply them to their own life. In the days following their encounter with Marcus, Alex becomes increasingly immersed in the study of Stoicism. They read extensively, attending lectures and workshops to deepen their understanding of the philosophy. One of the key principles that resonates with Alex is the importance of reason. Alex learns that Stoicism emphasizes the use of reason as a tool for navigating life's challenges. By applying critical thinking and logic to their thoughts and emotions, Alex begins to see the world in a new light. They start to separate facts from feelings, recognizing that not all thoughts and emotions are based on reality. As Alex practices using reason in their daily life, they begin to notice a shift in their perspective. Instead of being consumed by negative thoughts and emotions, Alex starts to approach challenges with a more objective and rational mindset. They learn to ask themselves questions such as, is this thought or emotion based on facts, and what is the most reasonable course of action to take? By applying reason to their life, Alex begins to feel a sense of clarity and direction. They are able to make more informed decisions and take more effective action to address the challenges they face. Alex also finds that by using reason to manage their thoughts and emotions, they are able to maintain a greater sense of inner peace and stability, even in the face of adversity. As Alex continues to practice using reason, they begin to share their newfound insights with others. They engage in discussions with friends and family members, encouraging them to apply the principles of Stoicism to their own lives. Alex finds that by sharing their knowledge and experiences, they are able to help others find greater meaning and purpose in their lives. As Alex delves deeper into the principles of Stoicism, they begin to explore the concept of self-control and the dangers of desire. They learn that Stoicism emphasizes the importance of cultivating self-discipline and restraint, particularly when it comes to our desires and impulses. Alex reflects on their own life and the ways in which their desires have led them astray. They recognize that their pursuit of material possessions, status, and external validation has often come at the expense of their own happiness and well-being. Alex realizes that by constantly chasing after these desires, they have been neglecting their own inner growth and development. Determined to break free from the cycle of desire, 
Alex begins to practice self-reflection and mindfulness. They take time each day to sit in quiet contemplation, examining their thoughts and emotions with a critical eye. Alex learns to identify their desires and to distinguish between what is within their power and what is not. As Alex practices self-control, they begin to notice a shift in their behavior and outlook. Instead of being driven by impulse and desire, they are able to make more thoughtful and deliberate choices. Alex finds that by restraining their desires, they are able to focus more on what truly matters to them, such as their relationships, their values, and their personal growth. Alex also begins to share their insights on self-control with others. They engage in discussions with friends and family members, encouraging them to examine their own desires and to cultivate greater self-discipline. Alex finds that by sharing their knowledge and experiences, they are able to help others find greater fulfillment and meaning in their lives. As Alex continues to practice self-control, they begin to feel a greater sense of inner peace and stability. They recognize that true happiness and fulfillment come not from the pursuit of external desires, but from the cultivation of inner strength and wisdom. Alex is determined to continue on this path of self-discipline and restraint, knowing that it is the key to a life of greater purpose and meaning. As Alex continues to apply the principles of Stoicism to their life, they are faced with a series of challenges that put their newfound resilience to the test. First, Alex receives news that a close family member has been diagnosed with a serious illness. The news hits them hard, and they find themselves struggling to cope with the uncertainty and fear that comes with such a diagnosis. Despite their best efforts to remain calm and rational, Alex finds themselves consumed by worry and anxiety. They begin to neglect their own self-care and well-being, focusing all of their energy on supporting their family member through this difficult time. As the situation becomes more challenging, Alex begins to question their ability to handle it. It is at this point that Alex remembers the stoic principle of indifference to external events. They recall the teachings of Marcus and the importance of recognizing that true happiness and fulfillment come from within, regardless of the circumstances we face. Alex realizes that while they cannot control the outcome of their family member's illness, they can control how they respond to it. With this realization, Alex begins to practice indifference to the external events unfolding around them. They focus on what they can control, such as their own thoughts, emotions, and actions, and let go of what they cannot. Alex finds that by practicing indifference, they are able to maintain a greater sense of inner peace and stability, even in the face of such a challenging situation. As Alex continues to navigate the ups and downs of their family member's illness, they are faced with another challenge, a financial setback that threatens to derail their plans for the future. Once again, Alex finds themselves struggling to cope with the uncertainty and fear that comes with such a situation. However, by this point, Alex has developed a strong foundation in Stoic principles. They are able to apply the lessons they have learned about reason, self-control, and indifference to external events to this new challenge. Alex recognizes that while the financial setback is a significant challenge, it is not the end of the world. They focus on what they can control, such as their own spending habits and their ability to find new sources of income, and let go of what they cannot. As Alex continues to practice indifference to external events, they begin to feel a greater sense of inner strength and resilience. They recognize that true happiness and fulfillment come not from the pursuit of material possessions or external validation, but from the cultivation of inner wisdom and strength. 